And I'll tell you guys a little secret here. When I look at new deals, existing companies that I'm being asked to either fund with debt or equity, the first thing I do is I don't take the meeting with the CEO. I ask to go and drink good wine with the man or woman running sales. And I say, look, you know, I'm not available in that city, so I'll pay to fly her or him out to New York, and I'd like to just have dinner with them. And often the CFO was trying to broker the deal, says, no, 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 I'll come with them. I said, no, 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 no. I like to meet with the head of sales, and I, it's just kind of a ritual, that's how I work. And good wine, I'm talking good wine, and the head of sales, and three hours, and I can tell you everything about that company. Because the head of sales knows where, the, where, where things are buried. They know where the problems are with the customer base. They know where the opportunities are. And my point is, the CEO, the next meeting is with the CEO and the CFO. And if they know less than I do about their company from the salesperson, I know who to fire when I get control of that company. And it's not the head of sales. In my companies, there's no cap on the compensation for the man or woman that runs sales, ever. They're always the highest paid person, always. And so talk about a team. You want to interview from the sales down. Without sales, you don't have a company. Get to know the sales team, then meet the logistics people, then meet, you know, I'll tell you the truth. CEOs are fungible. You can get a new one anytime. They are the captain, and if they can't lead the ship, you got to swap them out. And I, I, I know that sounds terrible, but I help CEOs that are large shareholders get out of the way of success sometimes. I've done it multiple times now because they're not the right person. Teams, team leaders, like great quarterbacks, understand what they're not good at. There's nothing worse than an arrogant CEO that thinks they're good at everything. I just can't wait to shoot them. And on that cheerful note, <laughs>